let's jump into some clearing energy. So again, if you're desiring to fully receive, you can just lean back, relax, close your eyes to receive all the healing energy. And if you're busy, if you're doing other stuff, that's also totally fine. Cool too. Okay. So do you want to clear release and let go of any and all negative stories, belief systems, and energies that have come up around everything that you just wrote down, that you just thought about when I asked, and that you can allow yourself to clear release and let go of the baggage that's been weighing you down or holding you back. And if you'd like that, you can say yes. even like shaking that off for some people, especially if you like, like tapping, like you can tap on your chest, oh, like really getting this out of your body. Ugh. <sighs> Taking deeper breaths as we clear. Mm, supporting your human cap. So do you want to clear release and let go of the junk, negative energy, shame, and embarrassment around your perceived failures, around not having a client over a year, around the stories that men will pay for, but I want to work with women, that only this type of person or these types of humans will pay for it and actually don't want to work with them. They're not my soul line people. And any and all incongruency with that. And you want to clear release and let go of that. You can say yes. Do you want to clear release and let go of the wounding and hardships that you've experienced with rejection around hearing no and not liking it? And the fear that the nose means something about you, that you're actually not worthy, that you're actually not a good enough coach or a practitioner, that you can clearly and let go of any and all stories around that. And if you'd like that, you can say yes. And you want to know what it looks like and feels like to allow yourself to energetically stay and hold with the higher ticket rate that you're desiring regardless of what the external world is showing you, that you can stay true and clear to the divine soul line client who is a yes and an energetic match to you at 8K, at 10K, at 15, 20, 30K, wherever you're at. And if you'd like that, you can say yes. And you want to forgive yourself completely in all levels? For any and all stories, excuses, justifications that you've had of why you're not there yet, of why it hasn't worked, and for not knowing what you didn't know at the time. And also forgiving anyone else who is co-creating with you as an actor on your stage these experiences. You can also forgive them on all levels so that you can move forward with a clean slate. And if you'd like that, you can say yes. And as like a side note on that, the forgiveness is for you. You don't have to like go and be like, hey, I need to forgive you. Unless you're genuinely called to go do forgiveness work with someone. The forgiveness is for you to energetically clear that out. So it's not this like heavy thing still holding you back. Okay. And do you want to know what it looks like and feels like through your higher power to create a harmony between yourself, your soul's mission, and all the time that you desire? with your family, with self-care, with your children, with your passion projects, and that you can allow yourself to create and to continue to co-create a deeper union and harmony within your masculine and feminine energies to support you in realizing that with the most amount of ease, sweet grace, joy, and love. And if you'd like that, you can say yes. And you want to know that it's time safe and that you're completely able to co-create the life that you're desiring and that you can see through your higher powers, truth, wisdom, perspective, knowledge, and understanding what inspired action baby step to take and to continue taking as you grow, evolve, and expand. And if you'd like that, you can say yes. Okay. And then as a conscious piece for like the balance, a lot of people are trained and conditioned to see balance as like 50, 50, like work and home time. Like there's a scale that's like, it has to balance out. And that's not the only way that balance exists. 
balance can also be seen as like a harmony of like, oh, sometimes I do a little bit of this, a little bit more feminine energy, time to myself, time freedom. Sometimes I do more masculine energy, doing energy, structure energy. And you can play in like the dance of it. And harmony tends to feel a lot more possible and realizable for humans than this like theoretical 33, 33, 33 balance of these main three priorities or 50, 50 of my work and my home life. So do you want to clear release and let go of any and all old stories, societal conditioning and programs around what work-life balances and around what you quote should or should not be doing in your business and in your personal life. And if you'd like that, you can say yes. Okay, that feels better. And I love that people are like, yes, harmony, yes, harmony, yay. <laughs> harmony is awesome. Okay. So do you want to know what it looks like and feels like to tune into where your comfort level is with receiving money for the work that your soul is here to do and where your higher self is actually calling you to be at and embody now? And that you can notice any and all incongruencies between that for your personal work with private one-on-one -on -one clients, with group clients, with memberships, with wherever you're at for whatever your offering is. You can see and feel into any gap or difference that's there. And if you'd like that, you can say yes. And you want to know what it looks like and feels like for your higher power to close these gaps, to give yourself permission to have full alignment with what your higher self is calling you and is fully ready to show up and serve on this planet and that you know what it looks like and feels like to honor your human as you grow here. And if you'd like that, you can say yes. And do you wanna know what it looks like and feels like to continue to grow your comfort zone over your lifetime as you grow, evolve and expand? and to then create new standards when you expand your comfort zone so you can hold it at this level without crashing back down, without going back other levels, without having a consequence or a quote cost to yourself financially, personally, within people in your family that you love, that you can clearly and let go of any and all scarcity belief systems or like catastrophic belief systems that like if something's really great over here then something else over here has to pay and if you'd like to clear any and all of those you can say yes okay and then the I've never sold one so do you want to know what it looks like and feels like to do something that you've never done before that it can be fun and enjoyable, that you can be lit up by it, that you can be co-creating with the most aligned human who's never invested at that level, who's totally invested at that level. And it's just like, oh yeah, this is just like where I live. That you can have full possibility of the infinite opportunities of co-creating your highest ticket package with another soul who's so ready to be served by you. And if you'd like that, you can say yes. Yes. 